Today I'm going to show you some quick tips for working with a double layout. The first thing I'm going to show you how to do is how to make a guide. So I'm going to start by making a new canvas. Um, and since this is a double layout, I've doubled the width, so it's 24 by 12. And then what I want to get first is my ruler. So I'm going to do that using a shortcut. I'm going to hit Control R on my keyboard. And you can see that brought up this ruler here, and it's in inches. If you right click, you can change what the units are, but I want it to stay in inches. And then if I just, with my arrow tool active, I'm going to come over here, I'm going to click on the ruler, and then I'm going to drag out, so I can drag out this guide, and it will stay there, um, so I know where the crease is. If you want to hide it, you just have to hit Control semicolon, and it will go away and it will come back. Um, if that shortcut isn't working for you, you can always come here to Edit and Preferences, and then you can find um, units and rulers here. So right now it's set in inches, and you can change it there as well um, if the shortcut didn't work. Another useful way, sometimes I do this, is I just start out with a regular size canvas at 12 by 12. Um, and I'm just going to go ahead and make a new layer. And I'm just going to fill that with any color. And then I'm going to come up here to Image Canvas Size. And I'm going to adjust the size here. Um, and I want it to get bigger from one of these sides. And I'm just going to say OK. So now I have this background layer over here where, so I know where the middle is. And you can also duplicate this layer, select the background, then with the arrow you can move that over to the other side. So now if you need to align things in the middle of the left or right side, um, it's pretty easy to do that. So if I were to make a shape here, um, and I want it in the middle of the right side, I can just click on these two, and then with the arrow, I can move it, and now it's in the middle there. And then, of course, I can turn these off later as I'm just using them for guides. So those are two methods that I use when working with a double layout. Then when it's time to save, um, what I do, because if you're uploading to a printing service, you will need the left side and the right side. So what I do is I f go ahead and flatten the image, and then using the canvas size again, I'm just going to crop it down to 12, and then using this thing over here, I'll just crop down to the left side, and that will give me the right side or the left side. So I can go ahead and save that um, as you know my JPEG left. And then I can go ahead and undo that and crop it, but this time to the right side. So then you'll end up with you know, the right cropping so that you can upload it.